Az volt a szírom, hogy egy történet elmondjak, hanem az, ami vezetett leginkább, hogy megmutassam ezt az egész világot. Talán az, hogy eddig is írtak cigányokról, fölülül nézve, kívülül vizsgálva, belül alig látták, alig ismerték. A cifra színek mögött vagy éppen a mosolygó arcok mögött nem látták az igazit, nem látták azt, amit visszafogyatok magukban, azokat a szenvedéseket, amelyek végeredményben fűtötték őket, vagy visszafogták. The color of smoke can be compared perhaps to um, a book like A Hundred Years of Solitude. You see Lakatosh's voice um, opening up the kind of magical realism that Garcia Marquez's voice did for Colombia, for Latin America. Often the stories of Roma are told through the voices and through the eyes of non-Roma, of Gaje. And so this kind of, this is really a treasure in so many ways because it opens up a world for Roma and for non-Roma alike that we, we've really not had access to. It's very important to, to have this work uh, and kind of like get rid of with a, with a really broad stroke and brave motion to get rid of all these uh, preconceived notions. These are people, first of all. I would like my children to read The Color of Smoke, but I would like everybody to read The Color of Smoke, Roma and non-Roma alike, because for Roma, uh, Lakatosh really opens up a world that we don't have access to anymore in the current moment. For non-Roma, it opens up, I think, the complexity and and the the engagement uh, of Roma within communities within family it opens up Romani everyday life for all of us. <laughs> <laughs> 